was winning like Boston with the 80s underway. The Eagles were good and the Sixers were led by Malone and Dr. J. The Phillies had won the World Series and the Flyers were number one. And Rocky Balboa was champion still and not just a washed up bum. Then one fateful construction decision led to a mighty fall. When Liberty Place went up higher than a statue on City Hall. Now who would have guessed that this progress could damage a city within? There'd be no more titles for Philly because of the curse of Billy Penn. Thanks to the curse, I don't know what's worse. A team that never has hope or a team that believes only to leave the Philly fans trying to cope Since they have suffered it's gotten much tougher to ever expect them to win It makes a fan wonder how long they'll be under the curse of Billy Penn Now no one suspected the spirit of Penn was rightfully to blame Two decades ago when the Flyers lost Lord Stanley's seventh game and no one could tell that the bat of Joe Carter contained an ancient quill Sealing the fate of the 93 Phillies signed by their body bill The Philly fans thought that the Sixers had an incompetent GM But now we can see that the trades that they made were all forced by William Penn In the Super Bowl lost to New England he conducted a clear attack Cause he sucked the life right out of the Eagles quarterback Thanks to the curse, I don't know what's worse A team that never has hope Or a team that believes only to leave The Philly fans trying to cope Since they have suffered, it's gotten much tougher To ever expect them to win it makes a fan wonder how long they'll be under the curse of Billy Penn. Yes, it makes a fan wonder how long they'll be under the curse of Billy Penn.